So what's good guys, it's your boy Zonji, do you know what I mean, you locked in, WTT was the title basically today, I've got to talk to you about very important things, that is basically, I've got to, the title today is negative people in the music industry and music syndrome, you know what I mean, so a lot of musicians have got music syndrome, like basically hate syndrome, hate syndrome is basically where they, a lot of musicians they're not trying to support each other, they come across like the people, you know what I mean, they they, they they talk about people's opinion, they have lots of opinion in your music, but by the end of the day, some of them, they're not even famous. But I've seen uh, many people that will actually, uh, they're willing to 100% work. So if you are an artist trying to make it in the music industry or a musician, you try to make it really in the music industry. Don't listen to negative people. You might listen, uh, you might want to sit down and talk to, about how can you improve, how can you make your vocal sound better or your rap music video sound better but don't try and listen to negative people because negative people, especially also when you come to the studio guys, just think, make sure, yeah, a lot of people that you associate with doesn't, I'm, I'm not saying that you don't have, you don't have to have a friend but you should have a friend, at least they have a similar, do you know what I mean, aspiration, motivation and things like that but when you always try to go in ne with negative people, they're not going to do you any good because they're going to just waste your time and waste their own time but because if you're not on the same wavelength as them they're going to say oh no this is that this is not really doesn't work properly doesn't do that doesn't make sense and I feel like me and my own self yeah, I, do, I do I do I do music very well and I, it's not like doing the music very well but I don't really give a fuck yeah because if you guys come over and talk to me like this is what's the title yeah because don't give me your give me your honest opinion. Don't give me your fake opinion. Your fake opinion doesn't really solve for good. You know what I mean? Because like some girls might talk about different things. That like, might talk about politics. Might talk about uh, not talk about social social socialism or social life outside. Because if you're trying to socialize outside, but then think make sure you're socializing properly. You're thinking that there's one thing that you can actually navigate through by going here trying to make. Uh, connection with different people and things like that but because I see yeah uh, I see one some of you and a lot of you you may not notice when you're when you're claiming that to know something and to know of something you need to dump butt in your opinion and things like okay but you right but the other people that are not right this is absolutely nonsense yeah doesn't make no sense whatsoever I've just I'm, of course I'm rattling right now but and a good point because I'm saying the point that the point that I'm saying I'm, I'm, I'm telling you about right now guys is that musicians they don't support each other uh, especially up up and coming musicians you know up and coming musicians they have that you know what I mean a hate syndrome hate syndrome where it's actually trying to hate each other but and each other rather than support each other because if you don't do that you don't really do yourself good because these days if uh, it's all about promotion if you're trying to promote yourself proper for example you need to have proper money to promote yourself if you don't have that uh, at the moment to try to work with any artist try to collab make a collaboration with a lot of artists musicians uh, uh, rappers you know hip-hop dancers you know what i mean and, and get people together in the same spectrum as you because you know what I mean? Because I, I I look I look at myself today as a as an artist. Yeah, I've I've just I've just grown apart. You know what I mean? I've just grown apart from all of these kind of hatred and people just uh, trying to put you down all the time. You know what I mean? From negative relationship. Do you know what I mean? Because sometimes some guys that you know what I mean, the girlfriends get involved in the thing or boyfriends get involved in the thing, if she's an artist or he's an artist, so like the girlfriend, oh you know I hate this, I hate that, you know what I'm saying, well, I don't like your music and blah 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 blah, you prefer the music better than me and, and, and things like that, but because because you don't really support your own people, you don't really support your own uh, like, like relationship because you know that relationship doesn't work that way, because if you've got a hobby, you've got something that career of music, you want to be a musician, Make sure your partner is actually in the same wavelength as you. If they don't really understand that, then you have to put them on, put them on, on, put them down, set them down, and speak to them and let them know, guys. Can you just make sure? Don't try to put a hate on me, and do not try to put me. You know what I mean? Like I'm trying to choose one over the other. I'm not trying to choose one over the other because that's a career, that's a hobby, that's something that I love. But a relationship is something separate. But where they should, they should have 
paid you a homage, they should have paid you an uh, accolade for that kind of things. And they understand, listen, guys, I am here to support you no matter what. I'm with you, I'm standing by your side. Same as uh, dancers, are also the same thing. But you, man, yeah, need to understand this. Don't try to hate in each other. By the end of the day, what's the title of the stage right now for me? You, man, stop hating in each other's music. Support each other and make sure there's a there's a room for everywhere. You know there's a room for everyone to eat by the way in the music industry because no matter what they're gonna like your message, they're gonna like your music. Not everyone's is going to like your music. That's hundred percent for sure. But also there's a lot of some different people who are going to like your music. But for you, make sure you capitalise on those and be together. That's what's the title today. We spoke about that a lot of a lot of different things that I like. Do you know what I mean? For me as a musician. I've got no hate whatsoever, whatsoever for somebody else that up and coming artists. I, I only want to support my own music and somebody else that want to make music. That's how it is. But if you do, you think you're doing that, you are not going to go further. You're not going to go ahead in the music industry. Period. I'm not saying this because I'm trying to talk palaver, palaver. I'm saying this and because uh, I've seen it and I've witnessed that in my own life. A lot of people that I, you know, what I mean, I came across. You know, sometimes they might try to be like or oh, friend of me, blah blah blah. Also, one thing as well, like the girlfriend, boyfriend, things like that, also kind of negative relationship will also put you off in the music industry and you won't really go further. You're not going to go ahead of your own career and make music, make your own music better and improve yourself because, like, you know, but this, let's cut a story short. But at the end of the day, music, musicians, they've got a hate, music hate syndrome that where one make them go further. But if you work with yourself, I work collab collaborative, uh, collaboratively together, that would be nice. Alright guys, that's the, only, that, that's the topic that I want to talk to you about today. And you know, we got, hopefully we've got a next topic, what WTT was the title, new guest every day. That's what we get, they get involved in the show and things like that. Today, I'm talking about just sending a message to people outside within the whole world. And, you know what I mean, it was in England, United Kingdom, other places. Alright guys, peace out.